My name is Marty Coomer. I'm the Alberta rep for Wallinga in Northern BC. Uh, what you see behind me is the Wallinga blower system tied under the dryer. It's an Eco 1690 dryer. This particular Wallinga system is a 50 horse, five inch system. It's unique in moving the product from the dryer to the bins. One of the big selling features of this system is when the customer is drying and he's got the dryer full and if he's going into surge bins, then the next morning he has to move all the grain. Whereas with an air system, it's already moved to the dry bins and it's done. Next morning he can go to work combining or whatever duties he has to do. It's like having an extra hired man. With the Wallinga system, they're all three phase motors. You can get some single phase and then we increase them to three phase. With this one is a 50 horse. It's a small footprint. So when you're piping bins, you can pipe them in a row, in a circle, from each side of the dryer, multi-directional. This is running at about 450 bushels an hour, you can hear. It's fairly quiet. Um, a lot of people think air systems are quite noisy. It is quite quiet on the five inch system. We use on the Wallinga five inch aluminum pipe. It's 120 wall and we use steel elbows. It's all tubing, 120 wall as well. So it's 11 gauge. Systems range in capacity right from 50 bushels an hour up to 2,000 bushels an hour, depending on the size of piping, horsepower, and everything you put into the Willinga system. It's a relatively low cost option. If you're doing the same system with a leg, conveyors on top of the leg, you can be in at 800,000, 600,000. A Willinga system would be quite a bit less money, and everything is on the ground. All your motors, your elbows on the bottom, there's elbows on the top to look at, but all the maintenance is done on the ground. There's no climbing ladders to, to look at motors or bearings, what have you. So if you want more information on the Wallinga handling system, contact your Flamin dealer.